come to Eternal Manna, the daily devotional broadcast of Grace Gospel Church. As we begin a new week, we want to look at Philippians chapter 4, verse 18, the second part of that verse. And the second part reads, they are a fragrant offering, an acceptable sacrifice, pleasing to God. Now, Paul is using three terms to describe the giving of the Philippian church. And the first expression is, your giving is a fragrant offering, a fragrant aroma. The pleasant aroma of the costly perfume that Mary used to anoint the feet of the Lord Jesus Christ, as described in John chapter 12 and verse 3. Every time we give, it is a fragrant aroma in the nostrils of God. Listen to Ephesians chapter 5 and verse 2. Walk in love just as Christ loved you and gave himself up for us an offering and a sacrifice to God as a fragrant aroma. The sacrifice of the Lord Jesus Christ on the cross was a fragrant aroma in the nostrils of God the Father. The gifts of believers are as the fragrance of incense in their acceptance with God. The Levitical sacrifices were a soothing aroma to the Lord. And you can read of that repeatedly in the book of Leviticus. Now, this is pretty revolutionary and radical, isn't it? That every time you and I give to the Lord as an act of worship, it is a fragrant aroma in the nostrils of God. We don't normally look at our giving like that, but that is what the apostle is teaching us. The second word that uh, the apostle uses is that it is an acceptable sacrifice. Acceptable means God welcomes it because the motives of our giving are pure. God welcomes each gift that we give in his name. Acceptable sacrifice because sacrifice is involved in every act of giving. If you look at the Old Testament sacrifices, you have blood sacrifices for sin, for sin issues. But then you have other types of uh, sacrifices and they are to thank and to praise the Lord. And so our giving fits into that second category that uh, we are giving in order to thank and to praise the Lord. This love gift from uh, the apostle to the apostle from the Philippian church pleased God and it relieved Paul in his distress and it greatly enriched the Philippian church. So I want you to keep in mind that every time you and I give, our gifts are a fragrant aroma to the Lord. They are an acceptable sacrifice and God is totally pleased with it. It's almost like God is applauding and uh, saying, well done. And uh, we need this reminder, at least I need this reminder, that when I give, this is how God looks at my giving. This is the divine perspective of uh, my gifts given to the Lord. So may God give us the grace to so give so that our gifts are a fragrant aroma, acceptable sacrifice, well-pleasing to the Lord. Amen. For more videos like this, please subscribe to our YouTube channel
Grace Gospel English Church Toronto. Thank you.